display standards. If we run a standard Anartios CAT 7.6, you will see that next to the existing list of corrugated and folding card standards, we added some display standards. Now this is not a list of ready-made one-piece displays, because displays come in all kinds of shapes and varieties. This is why we prefer to offer a list of components, so the designer can choose whatever element he needs in his display, run the standards and combine them in 3D. As you can see there are some display bases, there is a group of headers that can be put on top of that. We have some trays, for example here with some dividers, an angled tray, some easels and fillers. As I mentioned, in this way the designer can pick the elements he needs, run the standards and combine them in a 3D assembly. If we take a look at one example, for instance a display base, you will notice that running a display standard is no different than it used to be for cards. We can enter dimensions or values for some variables like length, width, depth, angles or offsets, confirm the values and our two-dimensional design is ready. If we do the same for the other components and then bring them together into one 3D design, you see that we have all elements together. The base, a tray and a header. Now we can assemble all components manually but we can also use a new feature from 7.4 and that was the mate or glue tool. I added myself these little triangles which match in 3D and with one simple click I can assemble them. Same story for the header and so this way you can see that combining display standards and using the mate and glue tool you can have quite a powerful solution for displays.